I used to love the nightlife and hang out in a bar. I used to hit the bottle, but then I hit a car. I'm laid up in a wheelchair, paralyzed for life. Got money through a settlement to see me through the strife. My attitude is different now, the future's not so bleak. I even got a mansion and filled it full of freaks. It's my life, such as it is. My life, such as it is. Such as it is. My seven friends are with me, they're brilliantly deformed. I got a girl called Franny, my shoulder from the storm. Don't touch your points of pity, the hard times never last. Without a leg to stand on, I still manage to kick ass. It's my life, such as it is. My Such as it is, such as it is Paralyzed, paralyzed for life Six fall in the corner pocket Hey, I don't think I'm getting the hang of this Ready for another scotch? Another? I've been drinking water all night Gross Do you have any idea what fish do in water? Screwing and pooping? It's disgusting. So how long you been sober now? Oh, geez, I have no idea. I guess about six weeks, three days, 14 minutes, and 36 seconds. Wow. I haven't been sober that many days in my life. Total. See, sobriety is just a crutch for people who can't handle being drunk. Hey, it's great to see the world through eyes that aren't crusted shut. Besides, I enjoy a cold glass of water as much as a beer. Right, except for the taste and the effect. Drinking makes the world a better place. And drinking, even more than smoking, makes you really cool. He's right. I do miss it. Will somebody get me down already? This wasn't funny an hour ago and it still isn't! Who wants eggnog? Uh, no egg, just nog. We could be a little more sensitive. Riley's trying not to drink over the holidays. I'm okay, guys. I enjoy the other festivities, the true meaning of Christmas. It's your religious duty to drink at Christmas. If God didn't want us to, why did he give us livers? Excuse me, Billy Graham? When did you become such an expert on religion? You know, not many people know this, but the Virgin Mary? Big lush. She could really knock it back. Somehow, I question the veracity of your information. Hey, I read about her in that book. Uh, uh, what's it called? The Bible? Oh, that's the one. Yes, that's it. You know, and all that frankincense and myrrh stuff. <laughs> That was just different brands of tequila. Oh, great. The rich guy. Is that supposed to be some kind of insult? If so, I find it rather wanting. Blow me. Much better. I just came by to... That's our tree! You stole our Christmas tree! How dare you! You're right. Stealing is wrong. Just like, for example, it was wrong for you to steal my mobility. Actually, it looks quite nice there. Keep it. Well, okay, but you owe me one. Mrs. Bromberg and I are throwing a Christmas party for our Goyesha friends. And you want us to come? How lovely! Yes, we'll put you in a cage and tell our guests it's a petting zoo. No, you are not invited! I came by with a simple request. Do not step out of your house between 8 p.m. and 3 a.m. What's in it for us? You could scavenge the leftovers from our dumpsters. Good deal. Well then, I'll just let you get back to your squalid existence. Great view of his bald spot from up here, but will someone get me down already? Now where were we? Oh yes, that's right. I was just getting a buzz. Riley, you want? Stick to your guns, Riley. You can get through it without a drink. And you claim to be Riley's friend. Can't you see? He's in pain, wallowing in the depths of sobriety. Maybe I could have just one. I mean, it is Christmas. How could one whittle drinky hurt? One leads to two, leads to five, leads to a hundred. Hey, I had an accountant like that. Oh, come on, Franny. I'm just talking about one drink as a reward for having given up alcohol. But you've done so well so far. You're more alert, your memory is better. Not to mention your performance in the bedroom. Oh, mention it, mention it. 
tell you what, Riley. If you can stay clean over the holidays, I'll give you a special surprise. A sexual surprise? I'm not saying. Give me a clue. Does it involve our genitals? Fine. It's a sexual surprise. Can I videotape it? You know, baby, maybe you should get some support from other people who share your problem. Quadriplegic alcoholics? Why don't you go to an Alcoholics Anonymous meeting? Oh, I hate those places. Everybody telling their tales of woe. Do you ever want to see Miss Kitty again? You're right. Maybe it'll do some good. Can I scratch Miss Kitty's tummy? Mind your own business, Blazer, and get down from there right now. Well, got you done. <laughs> Touching story, Frank. You lost your wife, kids, job, dog, mother, father, sister, brother, car, clothes, house, and your ashtray collection, but you turned it into a successful country song. <sighs> Who's next? Briley, is that you? No, I can't do this. These meetings aren't for me. There has to be another way. Oh, come back. The rest of you, take a break. I gotta go through 12 steps? Isn't that something easier? Better? Now we're talking my language. Can you really help me quit for good in just one step? Hey, they don't call me Dr. Vito for nothing. What are you doing? This is the one step. What's the matter for you? You gonna stop drinking or what? Ow! You gonna stop? You stop drinking! You got that? Tell me you quit. Stop hitting me! Hold this. Does that look good to you? Yes, it's very tempting. No! It's not good! You hear me? No drinking! Okay, I won't! I swear! There, you're cured. To whom should I uh, send the bill? So, how did the meeting go? Pretty well. I guess I didn't realize how tough it would be not to have a drop over the holidays. Well, you're doing great. But what if I can't make it? I can't never built a bridge. And I can't never wrote an opera. Sure, because he was too busy drinking and having a good time. All right, then. Let's toast to Riley's... <laughs> sobriety. Excellent. I have a fabulously rare Merlot with an adventurous nose and a full fruity finish. Hey, sounds like Spalding. <laughs> Guys, we're trying to stop him from drinking? Oh, sorry, Riley. It's not that good. It's, well, it, it's just Rotgut Swill. Oh, I used to love Rotgut Swill. But you guys, go ahead. Nobody said it was going to be easy. <laughs> oh, come on, Rudolph. Play those reindeer games. <gasps> Hope you can handle the North Pole, baby. Oh, I can't believe you shaved your legs from me. Your reward for not drinking. If I make it through the week, will you shave you? Riley, you know how I feel about shaving that. Let's take it one hair at a time. Next, the armpits. Ho, ho, ho! I'm coming down the chimney. I don't want our guests to see those nasty, nauseating neighbors. Oh, alliteration. Uh, I like that. Is everything else ready? We're all set. Uh, our Christmas party will be the most politically correct event of the year. Hey, Morty Bromberg celebrating Christmas ain't a bad start. Some matzo balls, a little kosher Christmas cake, everybody wins. Every Jew throws a Christmas party these days, but our party is going to have one of everything. Let's check the list again. A Hindu. Check. Muslim. Check. Buddhist. Check. Finnish nomads, Albanian gypsies, Australian aborigines. And a Canadian. We had to invite a Canadian. You know, who cares? He's a Canadian. Strike him. 
He'll probably apologize to us. <laughs> <laughs> He's right. It says good times. Yeah, I've earned it. What? What's going on? What's the matter, dear? Ah! <laughs> Snap out of it! I'm losing it. I need some air. Let's go for a ride. I gotta get some stuffing for the turkey anyway. Yeah, you better stuff it fast before Spalding takes it up to his room for a little hoochie coochie. <laughs> Poor baby. Get some air. It'll do you good. <laughs> What are you doing? Tasting the champagne. So I'll know if I want to buy it. Have some. Don't do it, Riley. Do it. Oh, don't make your old pal Grizz get all stink-faced and polluted on his lonesome. No, I'm strong. I'm not going to drink. Don't think of it as drinking. Think of it as stealing. <laughs> it's a little Christmas cheer. One sip, then you'll stop. Be a man. You're in control. Yeah, I can control it. What's the harm of one drink? <laughs> oh, that was good. Now I remember why I drank. Alcohol is my friend. It's not right to ignore your friends. Is everybody in? All present and accounted for. Back her up, Fontaine. Back her up. Nobody tells Franny I slipped. I should be so disappointed. But I think I just proved I can drink and handle it. Got it, Blazer? Where's Blazer? You said everybody was in. I did? I said that? If I did, I think I was wrong. Did the fresh air help? Oh, sure, yeah. I feel better. Except... I've lost Blazer. <laughs> what a mess. All because of one little drink. A little drink? You drank a whole bottle of Australian champagne, no less. Hey guys, wanna watch some TV? There's a new version of A Christmas Carol with Dr. Laura as Scrooge and Gary Coleman as Tiny Tim. Sounds great, but uh, I got some last minute shopping to do. You'll miss Pamela Anderson as the ghost of Christmas past. Well, tape it for me. We'll be back soon. Oh, and it's Gretzky all alone at Cinderay. <laughs> Now! I am not a hockey puck! I am a human being! Hey, Jim! It's good! Turn right here. How's that? Perfect. It's gonna take all night to cover the city. Fontaine, you blind guys have a good sense of smell. Maybe you can sniff out Blazer. Can't hurt to try. Oh, oh, this pie is way too hot. I'll just stick it out the window to cool it down. Well, I don't smell nothing. Keep trying. Ouch, ouch. This anvil is burning my hand. I'll stick it out the window. Nope, nothing. Keep trying. Ouch, ouch. This anvil pie is scorching. 
I'll stick it out the window. Ah! Mmm, sweet amber pie. Just like my mama used to make. <laughs> Bad dog, shoot! Uh, go away! Sit! Sit! Die! B -b 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 Back off, you stupid, f -f 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 -m miserable mutts! <laughs> hey! I am a human being! I am not an animal! <laughs> Excuse me, I'm looking for a little head. Well, you come to the right place. Oh my, you certainly are friendly in this part of town. <laughs> hey, lady, uh, you wouldn't happen to have seen a head around here, huh? No, my friend's nose is smaller. Closer, but no mustache. No, thanks anyway. I'll let you get back to being homeless. I don't think it's going well. Nonsense! It's going fine! They're having a great time! Marty, do something! Make a toast! <clears throat> so let's hear it for the old savior himself, JC! We weren't exactly the welcome wagon when you were here before, what can I say? Oops, we goofed. Here's to better days. A bad party. I'm committing social suicide. He's gotta be out here somewhere. We better find him soon. A head on his own doesn't stand a chance on these streets. Look, over there, it's Grizz. <clears throat> hey, guys. <laughs> Hello, me hearties. Maybe he's found something. Oh, Christ. <laughs> Smell like rush hour. Now where did they go? I've lost three friends in the city. I lost my battle with the bottle. I let down my girlfriend. I'm a bad quad. <laughs> no, you didn't let Franny down. She knows you're a worthless good for nothing. You came true for your old drinking buddy when it mattered. <laughs> I'm proud of you. And I'm buying the first round. Nothing for me. I'm not drinking. This time, I'm saying no. At least for now. Wow, you're so strong. It's really obnoxious. Mind if I have a short one? Hey, I don't tell other people what they can do with their brain cells. Good. We're friends and all, but you know I'd choose booze over you any day. I understand completely. Uh, but you come before aftershave. Come on, we gotta find our friends. And I gotta make amends. Hang on, if we're gonna see those clowns again, I need to be hammered. Are you sure you're okay to drive? I'm as sober as it. Uh, uh, let me back up. It's my fault? Since when is it law? You have to have your lights on at night. Hmm? Grizz? Is that you? You look terrible. You okay? Except for the indignity of being dragged off by a truckload of stray bitches and a stuttering dog catcher. Dirt! Riley, is that you? Over here, man. <laughs> I didn't know Blazer liked dogs. <laughs> Thanks, Blazer. I needed some cheering up. But quit fooling around. It's time to go home. Give him something to keep him warm. Here, you'd better have some brandy. <laughs> I've seen her happier. Trust me, I know how to handle an angry woman. Lie your ass off. To hell with you all, as long as we have alcohol. 
to, <laughs> go, go ahead, Riley. T- tell her about the, that kitten we rescued from the burning building. Franny, I fell off the wagon. And the truth is, no matter how hard I try, I can't be sure it won't happen again. It's okay. The point is you tried. And I'm proud of you. I'll be damned. He told the truth and she still ain't mad. I gotta try that sometime. Look! What happened? He died of boredom. Gee, great party you got going there, Liz. I wouldn't expect you to understand high society. Drink, Boy, drink, we don't beer have to take. Hey, the carol is a here, man. Drink, oh, pour me a whiskey, it makes me feel frisky. Come on, fellas, we gotta go. No, don't stay. I mean, don't. Stay. You mean stay and save your party? Ooh, I don't know. You'd have to ask real nice. Stay. Please. He is a traditional Christmas song we used to sing in Australia. Santa was a randy old fart, I saw him hump a reindeer. If Rudolph didn't get a turn, he'd sulk for half a year. I'm going to stay sober this time. I mean it. No thanks to you, Grizz. What? You should thank me. Blazer and I were just testing you to see if you could hold out. Right, Blazer? Yeah, and you handled yourself really well. Except for when you got sloshed, nearly got me run over by a car, then got me hopelessly lost in the most dangerous part of town. I got a hundred bucks. Says he won't make it till New Year's. Franny, I didn't even get you a gift. I got you something. No! You shaved your... Merry Christmas, baby. Second verse. Mrs. Claus liked to roll in the hay. She had to have it every day. When Santa was doing his Christmas duty, she'd grab an elf by his ears and shake her big old booty. Everybody now.